Hey everyone, so I wanted to do a um, another haul, oh my gosh, uh, but yeah, so I'm going to also break this up into two different videos because there's just way too much. This is pretty much a compilation of like, you know, Black Friday hauls uh, and, and the past couple of like weeks um, of shopping, so yep, I'm going to get started. So I got something at Ulta. And I wanted to get a few polishes. Actually, um, if you guys didn't know this on Twitter, but maybe about like two months ago, I had dropped my um, Orly Calcium Shield on the ground while, when I was like packing to go to Philly. And uh, so I've been needing to get a replacement. But I actually found this one, and this is just a mini size bottle, which is great because you can carry this anywhere. Um, but this is a nail defense, and I want to try it out. And so far, so good. So um, it's supposed to be for strengthening and repairing for the base coat. And then I got um, Not Like the Movies. It's a really pretty, pewterish, you know, all sorts of multicolored colors, and it's gorgeous. And then I also got um, Passion, which is like a very goldenish, molten gold color. It's very, very pretty. So great for the holidays. And then, of course, more nail polish, but this is from Chanel. And I wanted this one particular color. It's called Particular Coulier, and um, it is so pretty it's actually what i have on my nails right now um but it can't i didn't realize but this i ordered this from the chanel website and i didn't know that it comes in this little pouch but it's so cute and this is the color reminds me very much of um or opi's metro chic but um i really like it so and then also they gave me a few samples of um this is chanel chance and what's the other one? Um, Blue de Chanel. So can't wait to try these out. As if I need any more nail polishes, right? But I did pick up a few more in, at CVS. So so I saw at CVS there's these two colors here from Sally Hansen. Gorgeous, um, like pastel -y color, you know. Um, but this really reminds me of the mint green in um, SE. Uh, I think that was Candy Apple. And this one is C. Very pretty. And then uh, still on a peach um, like this is a peachy, very light peach pink color, and this is in sorbet. I think this, this is so pretty looking. And then I actually got two of the, um, <laughs> this is very different, but this is two of the Optic White um, Kogay that I wanted to try it out. But I had I had a dollar coupon for each of these, and they were on sale for like two for something. I forget what it was. I think it was like two for five or something, and then there's a three dollar CVS um, extra box, and then so I really ended up getting these for like eighty cents or something each of them. So this is actually a really good deal. And of course, you saw these lip butters on my blog. I have swatches for them. You can check it out. I'll link the blog post below. But I absolutely love these lip butters, and I don't think I have enough, really, seriously. Um, but. One Twitter follower of mine, you know, was so, so sweet. She, when she bumped into these, she had bought some extras, and she sent me those extras, and absolutely, you know, thank, cannot thank her enough. But, um, you know, I have Sugar Frosting, which is this one. This is not, this is my least favorite. Um, but there's Tutti Frutti, Cherry Tart, uh, Lollipop, um, what is it, Red Velvet, strawberry shortcake and cotton candy and just the other day it finally got into you know the stores around me and i picked up a few more which is um the one that's on my lips right now is actually um peach parfait and i really really like it, it um, i feel like it's very natural and it's almost like my lip color but a little bit shinier so i really like that creamsicle i hear this is actually not that great so i'm gonna i may i may go back and um, switch it for something else but who knows i may i'm gonna try to um see and here and this one here is the creme brulee um this is the color but apparently it's really really nice so i got that one and this one is the berry smoothie so i'll go ahead and update my blog with these new ones here and then also, I saw these here. This is the Maybelline Baby Lips. I have this one. It's um, 
I think it's the same idea. It's just a moisturizing lip balm. And this one's in Quenched. And then I got this one in Peach Kiss. So I can't wait to try these out. And then I also saw Sally Hansen having the same one. This is called the Vita E um, Lip Soother. And it comes in something like this. This is the vitamin, yeah, the vitamin E for um, care for rough lips or, you know, just very moisturizing. And so far I'm loving this. It's very smooth on the lips. But each one comes in a different color. And I, I think the color, the packaging is really cute. So... Um, and then at Sephora, I picked up the Kadali. Um, this one is in the Vino Perfect Radiant Serum Complexion Correcting. I don't know if you can see that, but it's like a milky texture. And just a, it's a serum before your moisturizer, so I picked this up. And uh, so far, so good. I really like it. And then, of course, everyone has been raving about the uh, Naked 2 palette. As soon as it got onto the website, I immediately went to purchase it. And, oh my gosh, I think within the hour or so, it was, like, sold out. So, I absolutely love the new packaging. It is, you know, it's not the velvety one that I have. Um, so, it doesn't get dirty as much. And it comes with an extra lip gloss. So, here's the original Naked. And then, compare it to the new one. And I absolutely love it. And it comes with a brush itself versus the actual um, pencil in the other one. And then just a comparison between the two, you can tell. The colors are different. I believe this does have a little bit more shimmery, um, but it, it seems like more of a cooler neutral color. Um, but let's see, they do have different names on it, which I don't have. So I can't wait to bring this along with me during travel. I absolutely love this. And I'm glad that it does come with um, a brush, a two-ended brush to go with that. And um, it couldn't have come at a better time because, as you can see, this here, the half-baked, my over, when I was in San Francisco, my nephew-in-law got into my naked palette. I was like, oh my gosh. When I turned around, I was like, my heart just sank. It literally did. And I was just like... I can't believe that because I, I took it away from him too and I kind of just like placed it away and somehow he got to it And I was like, oh my gosh, but yeah, it couldn't have come in a better time and I cannot wait to try this out so Yep, very exciting And when you order it online, it get, they give you an extra um, Urban Decay 24-7 This is in Eldorado So it's more like it's a golden, goldenish uh, color